How you doing today, folks? Uh, I just want to make a quick video today to show you the County Line 36-inch barrel fan. And I was at uh, Tractor Supply probably about a month ago, so it would have been like early June, late May. Uh, it was funny, it was like the first few warm days of the year, uh, and they were having a sale on barrel fans. So this 36-inch fan was like $169.99, uh, and then they had a 42-inch fan, which was like uh, $199.99. And I was torn between the, uh, the 36 and the 42, and the 42 was just, it was just huge. I mean, if you need the, the flow, get it. Um, I just, the 42 was almost awkward to move around. And what I bought this fan for is basically uh, when I'm working on things and I wanna have some air to blow, like today I'm doing my brakes to blow the, the brake dust away. Uh, or just in a hot summer day if I want to have a good air supply to cool me off. Uh, today it was 68 degrees out and I had the fan going the whole time I was working on my brakes and I never felt warm, you know, because you're, you're leaning over and using your muscles. Uh, but as soon as I stepped away from the fan, it was funny. I was like, whoa, it's hot out, you know? Uh, so I, I just wanted to kind of give you a quick comparison. So, so this is what your 36 inch looks like and right next to it there, that is a... 18 or 20 that's like a $20 box fan and the, the thing I noticed between the two fans is that the little fan kind of show throws like a like a direct stream of air uh, whereas the barrel fan here it's almost got like a hollow center it's more of like a it's more of like a, a wall of air or a gentle breeze of air as opposed to that targeted uh, flow for what I'm doing uh, this fan is absolutely perfect uh, I have a two-car garage, it's like 24 feet deep. If it's one of those warm summer days and you go in the garage at night and it's still like in the 80s at night, you can put this fan right on the uh, the garage door and just let it blow into the garage and you'll feel a nice breeze. You you have to kind of point it to where you're, uh, where you're working, but it's a pretty generous amount of air and a pretty wide airflow by the time it gets in the garage. Uh, but let me turn it on and, and just, you know, show you guys here. Let me, I brought my tape measure out. So let's see if I can extend my tape measure. So the fan is, uh, it's about 40 inches tall. And the width is, uh, give or take, it's about 36 inches wide, which it is a 36 inch fan, so that makes sense. Uh, and this fan has, it has two speeds. So what you've got is you've got a switch here with, with two speeds, and then there is a little plug over here. I haven't used it, I really don't see the point unless maybe you would put both fans in, in uh, sync there. But, um, uh, you know, there's a plug, I, I assume it works. But here's, here's the fan, and that is on uh, the lower setting. And the, you know, the thing I noticed about the fan is the noise level is pretty big between the low and the high setting. Here we are, we're behind it. And then, you know, I've got the mic pointed back at me so you might not hear it so well. But it's a very gentle, it's not like this high whirring, like, you know, you feel like the thing's gonna take off. It's a very gentle sound. And I'll see if I can find the CFM ratings, but the, the difference between CFMs at the low speed and the high speed really isn't that significant. And for the noise level, I think you'd, you'd prefer to run it low. So maybe if you need more air, just get the bigger one. See the leaves on the ground are kind of blowing. I mean, it's a gentle, it's a gentle breeze. I don't feel like I'm about to get knocked over. Um, but there's definitely a nice gentle breeze coming off of this guy. And uh, let's crank it into high. So that's how it sounds on high. For me, the quieter the better, so I prefer to use it on low. But um, yeah, I guess it is moving more air. Um, but that's just, uh, you know, uh, again, I got this mainly for when I'm working on stuff outside on a hot day. Luckily I've got shade, but it, shade and a breeze, you got it made. And also just because I wanted to blow any dust and chemicals away uh, I got the idea actually from Scotty Kilmer, who I think he got like a 42-inch fan uh, at BJ's. 
or Costco, he said. So uh, I thought it was an awesome idea, so I went and picked one up. This is the County Line 36 inch barrel fan. And we are, uh, we're running on high right now. So uh, thanks for watching folks, and we will see you soon. Take care.